And at pick 31, the Denver Broncos select Bradley Roby, cornerback from Ohio State University. Didn't expect to see him here this late, but you see a talent like that, you have to take it, although it's not a position of need for you picking at 31. But like I said, he's still here. you got to go after him. This is a guy that had eight interceptions, 36 passes broken up, 44 career passes defended. And he's the type of guy, when he gets to pick, and take it back the other direction. Had a few times in games where he let down his concentration, let players get the best of him. But when his game is on, it's on. He's one of the best in America. Very athletic, a fast twitch guy. You find the football, you find Roby around him. Like I said, has the ability to take it the opposite direction. If you want to go another direction for the Denver Broncos in an area of need is offensive line, in particular the guard position. Xavier Suafilo from UCLA was someone they could have taken and come in right away and played immediately. If you watch the Super Bowl, Peyton Manning had very little time to throw the football, was harassed from the get-go, and he's who you got to protect. They average 38 points a game. They're built on offense. Offense scores points, but instead they went defense. Suafilo was one of those guys that came in and helped protect Peyton Manning, who's your franchise. He's going to take you to the promised land. I give this grade a D, and the reason why is because you've got to keep to leave on your roster. You've got a young corner in Tony Carter. You didn't need to go out, but once again, Bradley Roby slips to you. you got to go out and get him. This is Doug Chapman, Pete Futek, and I will be here covering the whole first round of the NFL Draft.